me, becoming increasingly aware of the gap that exists at board and governance levels of an organisation. Many boards, too many boards, are seeing, and board members, see innovation as technology, and technology is something they're not comfortable with, they don't engage with it. Um, all too often you see um, innovation or technology being addressed as a subset of a finance committee or something like that, and they never get around to actually discussing the details, and if they do, they rarely understand them. Innovation is a portfolio of investments in business improvement. It's not one-off, it's not a one-hit wonder, it's not a magic bullet. It is continuous improvement, it is a set of rational, managed investments over a period of time and delivering over a period of time that create the organisation and the structure that you want to be. They fulfil your aspirations. And the issue that I have is that there is near zero visibility at board level of that investment. If you can't see the investment, if you can't manage the investment, how are you truly in control of the destiny of the company in the way that you are responsible and accountable to be? Sure, look, individual projects come up with a business case attached to them in a traditional way, as soon as the thing is approved, it's in a bottom drawer and never seen again. And there is a fairly strong degree of cynicism of the value of the numbers in any business case. It fails to understand that projects go through a life cycle and it is quite reasonable that at a certain point in a life cycle, often when the decision is made to proceed, there are many unknowns. But that information improves over time and you can accept inaccurate information at a certain point but must expect that it improves over time. So therefore you can manage the life cycle of these investments and see where you're up to and where you're going as that information improves. But the boards don't have their fingers on that. They don't have that within their control. And thus, innovation aware governance, an extremely important gap in the way we